got to the sweet end. It is sweet. We got food, hot dogs, drinks. They got it all set up for us. Everybody. Welcome back guys today. We are going to the Padres baseball game We're gonna be in a suite and it's gonna be awesome This is an experience we've never had before going to a professional game and getting to be in a suite But first we have to run over to Target This is the Target that Claire and Carmen love to come to every time we come down to San Diego It's a double-decker Target and they think it's the coolest thing in the world Even though we can visit Target any day of the week no, in Utah it's Not double-decker <laughs> The double decker, it gets her every single time. So we gotta run over there, grab a few things. It's literally right out the window, you can see it. Yep, it is, it's right, right across the street over there. The sun is making it so it can't, but anyways, <laughs> it's right across the street. We're gonna run over there, get a few things before we head off to the baseball game. And Clay is so excited to be going shopping with us. He loves it though. It's his very, very favorite thing to do. In and out, 15 minutes, we need to like call ahead, let them know we're coming so they have the doors open. The less time we spend shopping, the better. <laughs> you ready, no. Carl? More, more, more shopping. Always. Well, so we haven't been in the hotel pool yet. I don't know it's big, but it's nothing, nothing that cool, though. And they have a hot tub. Yeah. It's not yeah. that cool. How much? Yeah, it's just a pool. Just, just like a, a regular small pool. One of the elevators in here shakes like violently as it goes up and down. <laughs> it is not safe. It's scary. Yeah, I was like looking at the ceiling, like, I think you can push out the ceiling tiles if we had to escape. I've seen that in a movie once. <laughs> I don't think I would be able to get up there, but we could definitely save Carmen through the roof and <laughs> build a human pyramid. Guys, that's where our cheerleading skills are coming in. Mm -hmm. At the top, we're like, good night. <laughs> double target that we love. It's huge. A double target? This target has a thing that you can like put your cart on and it like carries it up to the next level That's for you. Yeah. yeah, a cart escalator. It's pretty cool. I'm a first timer today. I'm a first time here at the Target. Clay's never been to this target. You're in for a real treat. You gonna get that cart? Yeah. To get that dress, eh, it's not really my style. Sure. It's a little wild for me. Just there goes the cart. <laughs> I was watching the cart. Wasn't watching what I was doing. I almost tripped. <laughs> okay, let's go. What are we looking for up here? No, we don't need toys. I don't know if I mentioned this, but Austin and Owen have been staying at my sister's house, so they have not been hanging out with us a lot in the past couple nights. They're just hanging out there, swimming, living it up. Claire and Carmen are with us, so that's why you're not seeing them as much in the videos the past couple days, because they are not with us currently. No. <laughs> what can I get? No! That's not nice. Something small or nothing at all. That's not nice. Those are your options. Okay, what can you get? You got any ideas, Clever? Probably can because what? What do you want? Any like an American model? Okay, what did you decide on? This mama. <laughs> Purple mama. mama. As if she needs any more. She has zero room animals. on her bed for any more stuffed animals, but she's gonna keep adding to the collection. Stuffed animals. So true. <laughs> Did you come up with that? Yeah. <laughs> we found everything we needed from Target. Now we're headed back to the hotel. We're gonna have my brother and his two kids hop in here with us because we only have four parking passes for the game. So we're gonna kinda have to squeeze people in other people's cars and get everybody into the game. Carmen got her llama that she wanted. Clever didn't find anything other than a bag of hot Cheetos. So maybe right. you can get something at Disneyland. <laughs> I am. I got some smart food and popcorn. There's no way I'm eating stupid food. My, <laughs> my food has to be smart food. It's a joke. Yes, Just smart food. popcorn. <laughs> It's very tasty. Of the commanding general of National Training Center for Norway, Brigadier General Kurt Taylor, who will administer their oath. We just got to the sweet end. It is sweet. We got food, hot dogs, drinks. They got it all set up for us. We got lots of food over here. Oh man. Typical B 
baseball food. This is awesome. Some merch. A lot of fitted hat inside. Nice. Are you having fun? Dancing to the music? We're just getting done with the baseball game and unfortunately the Padres lost today but it was still super fun to be with all my family and my sister's friends in a suite. We've never experienced anything like that. It was really cool. I mean, we got all the food we could eat and ice cream, all the things. It was, it was great. It was, uh, it was my second MLB game for our senior trip in high school. We actually went to a Colorado Rockies game, so it's just funny that they ended up playing the Colorado Rockies. I don't remember who the Rockies played back in 2003, but it'd be funny if it was the Padres. That'd be funny. But it was cool to have the suite, like have the whole experience. The weather was perfect. It was a fun day. Yes. We are headed out to my sister's house. Tomorrow, Clay and the boys are headed back to Utah, and the girls and I are going to head up to Disneyland and spend a couple days up there with Amanda and her daughter. We're excited about that. And we have my little niece and nephew in the back seat. We're all gonna go and jump in the pool one last time before everybody has to head home and go their separate ways. I'm playing in the pool, are you having fun? Yeah. We are just getting back to the hotel a little bit late, but Terry is starting to get all of her stuff separated from mine so she can go with the girls to Disneyland tomorrow. We got a lot of clothes washed at her sister's house and uh, just kind of getting things prepared. They're getting up super early to head up there. I'm talking 5 a.m. We need to be on the road by six, so I'll probably be up around five. The girls probably around 5.30ish, so we can try and beat all the crazy rush hour traffic. I know that by the time we get to LA, we will for sure have traffic, but if we can at least beat the San Diego traffic, then we can probably make it to the LA traffic and not want to gouge our eyes out. <laughs> So me and the boys are gonna head out just a little bit later. Uh, we're gonna try to catch it after rush hour has happened. So I think around nine o'clock, we're gonna hit the road. It'll probably take us about 12 hours to get back, but well, gonna be another long day. Yes. Uh, we had a great time at the baseball game today. That was my second MLB game. It was cool watching it from a suite. And we wanna thank those people who paid for that suite and paid for the food. It was quite the experience for all of us, so. Super fun. Guys, we appreciate you hanging out with us. We love you. We'll see you guys back here tomorrow.